Hi, this is Irina, and I just like to share with you why I love listening to motivational speakers and what I have learned from people like Tony Robbins, Bob Proctor, Brian Tracy, Robert Kiyosaki, Donald Trump, Richard Branson, Napoleon Hill, Earl Nightingale, you name it. There are some amazing teachers out there that not only teach and preach, but they actually live what they teach and preach. I love Bob Proctor. He has been in the industry for over 50 years. He's been teaching and preaching all over the world to people, uh, not only ideas, but ways that they can apply to their lives to make a massive difference. Now, like with everything, knowing and not doing is really, what is that? Not doing, I suppose. Uh, it's like, you know, we accept a new idea, but we still keep on doing the old thing. So sometimes it's not the how-tos. Because someone said once that if how-tos were all I needed, we would all be skinny, rich, and happy. So it's not in the how-tos, because you find how-tos on Google, on YouTube, you name it. How-tos are absolutely everywhere for losing weight, making money, building a car, whatever it is that you're looking for to do. The secret really is, which is no secret at all, is in the why, is in the why would you want to do something different compared to what you're already doing. So people are happy with what they're doing, they're not going to do anything different. People are happy what they're doing, you can tell them, you know, you make, you change your life if you do this and this, but you know what, if they're happy with where they're at, they're not going to do it anyway. It doesn't matter how good it is. Really, you know, like there is a saying that uh, says when the student is ready, the teacher will appear. And what that really means is that it doesn't matter what you hear, what you see, if you are not looking to make a change in that area in your life, then it doesn't mean nothing for you. It's just like when, uh, when you go to the doctor and he tells you, hey, take all these pills, they'll make you feel better. Well, hello, if I don't feel sick, why should I take those pills? It's exactly the same thing with all the knowledge, all the wisdom that those people share with people like me and you, which means nothing if you're not looking to apply them into your life because you're not looking to make a change. So I love listening to people like these people that I mentioned before because each one of them has left an impression on me. Each one of them is doing something in me, uh, inspires me, motivates me, gives me wisdom to apply and I just absolutely love it. And as anybody uh, out there that is of some sort of significance and importance, they will tell you that it's the books you read and the people you listen to that will change your life. So that's why I love listening to people like Tony Roberts, uh, Robin, sorry, Bob Proctor, Brian Tracy, Robert Kiyosaki, Napoleon Hill, Earl Nightingale, Richard Branson, and all these incredible speakers out there. Check them out. They're worth their time. They're worth your time. All the best.